Are you looking for a faster way to edit, move, or delete multiple tasks at once in Asana? In this video, I'm going to show you how to do just that so that you can save time the next time you have to do this. Hi, my name is Samantha. I'm an online business manager and Asana systems specialist. In my business, I help other online business owners set up and optimize the free version of Asana. If you are interested in learning more about my services, feel free to check out the description below and all the links will be there. All right, before we get started, let me know in the comments what other tutorials like this you would like to see. What questions do you have about using Asana? Leave it in the comments so I can create more helpful videos that you want to see. Okay, let's get into the tutorial. So for example, if you have multiple tasks in a list that looks like this, um, and they can be in different sections, whatever, but they are in the list view, what you do is you can, so you click the top one and then you hit shift and then click the bottom one, or you can do click the top one and just select some of them in the list. So if you want this one and this one and this one, for example, you'll see I have three tasks selected. What I did was I hit control on each of those. So I click the first one and then I hit control and I hold control while I select the others and that will do that. Um, so, and then once you have the ones you want selected, you'll see this appear down here, this nice toolbar that lets you do a bunch of different things with those tasks. Awesome. And you can, so what you can do is you can move them between sections. So if I had another section here, for example, then I can move all of these into example two, just like that. You can also move them with this, with these dots here by grabbing it, clicking it and dragging it into this one. You can also change the project that they are in right here. So if I wanted to add it to, you know, a different project, my Asana Essentials, and then I can also choose which section I, it goes to within that project. And you'll see it updates here. And then if I want it out of this one, I can click the X, but I don't want it in this one. So I'm going to click the X here. All right, you can also assign these tasks to someone. And you see if you select it they all get assigned to me you can also do that right here so if i wanted to they're all still highlighted but if i want to change who that's assigned to i can go like this you can also set the due date in those same two ways as well so if i wanted to set the due date for tomorrow you'll see they all appear as tomorrow you can also click the x here and it'll x out all of those dates you can also do the same over here and you can select the date in this area as well just like down here. You can also delete all of the tasks and then there are even more actions in here. You can mark them all as complete. You can add collaborators. You can copy the task links for all of them, which is really helpful. So you can see you can do so many different things by highlighting all of the tasks that can save you so much time if you need to do any of those things with multiple tasks instead of going through one by one, right? Uh, you can also do this in board view. So selecting them looks different in board view. What you do is you want to drag your mouse. So you click down and then you're going to highlight them all in this way. So you drag that little rectangle square, whatever, um, the select option over all of them. And you'll see the five tasks are selected and you have the exact same options in the board view. All right, there you have it. I hope that that was helpful for you. I hope that helps save you time when you do have to make changes to those multiple tasks all at one time. I hope this helps you so much. Um, all right. Let me know again in the comments what you would like to see in the future, in future videos. I would love to help you with the things that you are struggling with when it comes to using Asana. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.